Hey everyone, Jenna here from Star Family Wisdom. I'm coming to you from Sedona, Arizona, where I am based, uh, where I was guided to move by my Star Family. Uh, and I said yes, so here I am. And I want to connect you with Thunder Mountain right behind me. I'm at the top of Sugarloaf Mountain right now. And one thing that's really important in my shamanic practice and in the work we do in the rites of the Moon Aiki shamanic initiation is to connect with the wisdom of mountains. We connect with the wisdom of nature in so many ways and in a variety of practices, but we in one of the rites that you receive, one of the energy transmissions, we connect you with the wisdom of the mountains of the world. And we can think of mountains like Thunder Mountain, uh, some of the highest mountain peaks in the world as containing the wisdom of eras. They've seen the rise and fall of civilizations. They've witnessed it all and they contain the history of our world. They contain the energetic history of humanity. And so as we're on the path of connecting with wisdom and integrating that wisdom, understanding where that wisdom is coming from and using our connection with the mountains as a way to source our wisdom from the highest mountain peaks can be a really supportive and important practice because there's a lot of information out there and we can connect with all sorts of information, but we really want to integrate the wisdom that is of the highest vibration, the wisdom that is the purest and, and connects us with the truth of our reality, the truth of our being, the truth of our souls. And so part of our work in the Rites of the Moon Aiki and the shamanic initiation process that I take people through is to honor the purity of the wisdom that stems from this lineage of shamanism, the lineage of the Caro people of Peru. And, and we integrate wisdom that upgrades and transforms our energy field. And, and during the Rites of the Moon Aiki, you receive 10 energetic transmissions that do just that. We are working to clear and shift energy in your field, release and dissolve heavy, dense, traumatic energies, and we're replacing that energy with higher vibrational light codes that are meant to harmonize and balance and bring online the energy of the new human as that balancing and, and harmonization occurs in your field. So this is a, a really important part of, I think, someone's entry into the world of shamanism and a really important initiation that anyone can go through if they desire to be the new human and transform their minds, hearts, bodies, and energy fields to be that upgraded, transformed, illuminated new human. So it's my honor and passion to support you in becoming the new human, to support you in becoming the highest illuminated version of yourself and to support you in connecting with the wisdom of eras past and the wisdom that has been preserved to this day and the wisdom that can carry us forward into the next era of humanity.